All right, we went and got a selfie stick. Welcome to the vlog. Talk about Britain and then the Pansy Marines. We'll do Britain first. They passed that that vote, which it doesn't change anything. I don't think. Well, if I had the judge by the comment section, or maybe they're just paid trolls. I have, you know, always kind of confused me when other countries would sit there and come through and comment and be like, do you not realize you're surrounded by snakes? Those people, oh, he's, he's a good one. He's going to be with us. Oh, he's snake in the grass, he'll never win. Yet you're voting for the other snake. Mm -hmm. Okay. Who knows really what the underlying plan is as far as that vote. Other than it doesn't matter. You can see it on them. They're all together. They've got their plan. You're never getting out of the EU. I should say that to Britain. It's just how it is. Unless you start up a bloody revolution. That's all. Yeah. Seems like every other part of the world's having it. Might as well be us too. But it doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. You're staying in. They're all snakes. I'll let you know if I actually see a patriot. I did just oh the, the the Tory party and, and the Labour Party, the conservatives. You might as well just call them all left. Or dictators. They're no different. The only difference is what is it? Individual policies. Abortion or no abortion. Foreign policy is the same. That's the only difference. And I thought the whole reason for the Brexit was because you didn't like foreign policy. <laughs> oh, well, may I, I, I just get the impression that the UK people are not as awake as American people. And maybe I'm wrong. I hope I am. God, I hope I am. Okay, that is a bird. The Pansy Marines. As many of you know, my son is a pulley for the Marines. Staff Sergeant blah 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 one, Staff Sergeant blah 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 two, Sergeant blah 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 three, and I don't know what his rank is, but we're just gonna call him Staff Sergeant blah, 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 four. One, number one, is who my son generally communicates with. Two, play on player. <laughs> and three, that one's intelligent, has a thinking mind. Staff Sergeant 1 has a thinking mind too. Blah, blah, blah. If not gullible. Well, he started getting into Marines. And they're doing this stuff, you know, get him physically fit for boot camp and everything else. So for the first time in this kid's life, he actually cared about what his body looked like. Every once in a while, I see this. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I kid you not. Looking over in the passenger seat, he's flexing his muscles. Standing in the mirror, showing his leg, flexing his muscles. It's like, okay. Then he decided, you know, Gabe and I's workout routine, we're just subpar. Cause like, you should come with us, work out. No, mom, 
You guys don't work out as hard as we do. Really? Really? Oh, this gets better. He's sitting there and he bought these weights. He got a pull-up bar. I cannot do one pull-up. I can get about three inches off the ground, but I have a big ass and triple D tits. This ain't coming up. I'd have to have man muscles to get it up. And I don't want to look like that. So anyways, he's ragging on me about that. He's got these at 15 pounder and a 25 pounder. The youngest is all excited because he wants to be like big bubby. So beg mommy, you buy me a five pound weight, five pound weight? Yeah, I'll buy you a five pound weight. So he's getting the star treatment from his baby brother. Now all of a sudden, everything that I say, I'm an idiot. Good morning. Good morning. He is, for instance, like the beginning of the month, they went on this hike. Well, that's what he told me it was, it was a hike. He's like, you should go do it. It'll really work you out, you know, better than what you and Gabe already do. And I thought, okay. I'm getting kind of irritated with this whole one-up me thing. It's like, okay. And before that we did his, before we did, that's what we're doing today, his trail. Before we did his trail, this whole one-upsmanship was really coming to a head. So he's got these 25 pound weights and the one 25 pounder he holds it like this on both ends and he lifts it above his head and i was like okay and i'm watching him he is about five or six and then he he's done he gets tired i was like okay and we we're having our little moment you know what tyler i've pushed 300 pounds uphill a quarter of a mile you cannot do that I doubt it was a quarter of a mile, Mom. You exaggerate. Uh, no, I can measure it. And I've carried 80 pounds. Hmm, how long was that? I don't know, two miles? At a fast pace in hot, sweaty, humid weather. And not like teenager 20s, I'm talking recent history. He's like, whatever, mom, I think you exaggerate. Like, mm -hmm. So he gives me this 25 pound weight, his one usmanship, and tells me, we'll see how many you can do. I've got dog food heavier than that. I have cat food heavier than that. So I like, I get the 10. He goes, you don't have to show off. I'm yeah. not. Not showing off at all. It's okay. just I think you said just do it until I got tired. <laughs> Whatever. And he just kind of like put that frowny face. His face fell. <sighs> and he says, "Okay, well, do it till you get tired." So he gets 16, getting close to 20, and I stop because as much as destroying his ego is satisfying. I'm not about to try and kill him. So I stop and hand it back to him. And of course, you know exactly what he has to do. He's got to get to 20, just so he can beat me. Well, here's a fun part, back to this whole trail thing and why we're at where we're at. He decided we needed to go. We needed to experience what a real trail was. So here we are on this real trail. And just so you can see, this real, wonderfully flat, rolling hill trail that it is. This is like I went to work and I'm just walking. Nothing. And I was like, if this the measure of what a real workout is, they're the pansy-ass marines. 
I got little exercise things and stuff. I was like, oh my God. Oh my God. And the picture that comes to mind, it's just a bunch of men in their pretty clothes in an air conditioned room working out. That is the equivalent of how I see this trail. All the mamas and their babies and strollers, the ones that are starting their workouts, you know, the beginning class. You know, not like a real hiking trail where you have like a break of flat land that's matted down, followed by a lot of uphill and downhill, and I mean real uphill and downhill with washed out trails from recent rains. So you're constantly having to readjust your footing, working muscles you didn't think you had or that people in air conditioned rooms don't remember that they have. <sighs> but it gets better because he ends up with a boo boo on his ankle, and I'm a moron. Put some antibiotic on that, cover it up, and then you need to leave it open, put some Vaseline on it so it doesn't crack back open. I'll just put some Bactine on it, Mom. Did you tell Staff Sergeant blah 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 what? No, no, it's just a little cut. Get me some new shoes. If I get you new shoes, I'm getting you hiking boots. Well, now I see why he doesn't want hiking boots. Because the Pansy Marines are walking on cement. They need tennis shoes. <laughs> that stopped him. <laughs> Anyways. So this boo-boo keeps going. He doesn't go to PT. Because his boo-boo keeps opening up. Because he, you know, I'm an idiot. I don't know what I'm talking about. Even though that's what I, you know, learned. He finally goes to PT. After Staff Sergeant blah 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 one. Ask him where he's at. Staff Sergeant blah 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 one tells him to get some kind of special band-aid and gauze and put some some kind of ointment on it. But I'm the moron. Well, I, was, I didn't say nothing. Try not to have an argument. He's not going to be with me too much longer. I figured life will teach him all these lessons. And he can just learn the hard way because there's nothing that I'm ever going to say that's just going to make him listen. So he gets to the Walgreens. We're inside and he's looking for this special band-aid that Star Sergeant blah 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 one told him he had to get. <sighs> Calling. Because I sit there and I found, oh look, these will work. These are really tough. They're like blister band-aids. This will work. That is not what Staff Sergeant blah 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 one said, Mom. Oh, my bad. Calling. So you call Staff Sergeant blah 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 one. And I don't know what was said. But I tell you what, I wish he'd talk to me that respectfully. Yes, I do. So he gets what I picked up. Thank you, Staff Sergeant blah 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 one. I think that's how it would always be. Blah, blah, blah. Gotta put the head shake in. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 one. We get home, does exactly what Staff Sergeant blah, 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 one says, which is what I said, but you know what? I'm the idiot and blah, 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 one is a genius who walks on pansy trails. Boo boo wood's wonderful. I said, well, keep Vaseline, Vaseline, Vaseline on it so it doesn't crack open. Because you don't need any more antibiotic. It's not infected. No. Staff Sergeant blah, blah, blah once said. Can you tell how I feel about Staff Sergeant blah, blah, blah one? It's not really how I feel about him personally. 
It's more how irritated of what they turned my son into. A mindless moron who doesn't see the intelligence of others. Now for all you Marines out there who are probably upset about me right now. Well, I hope the crucible is a whole lot harder than this. Because if it isn't, we're all fucked. <laughs> I can do this with my eyes closed. You're not doing it right. You gotta be in an air conditioned room with weights. Oh my god. Mm. Well, I think I've rented and raved enough. I haven't even gasped for air yet. <laughs> My legs don't hurt. It's literally like I went to work. Maybe I should have brought the scooter. By the way, that was that 300 pound thing. It was a scooter. It had broken down. Damn it, I've pushed that thing more. The quarter of a mile uphill which is generous, not generous, stingy. I swear I think it was half a mile. Broke down, thing broke down all the time. Pushed that thing, pushed it, pushed it. Start at the end of the road into the country and push it home. Sometimes someone would be really nice with their truck and I'd pick up that thing with help. I'm not Hercules and throw it in the back and they give me a ride home. But I have pushed that thing miles, not always uphill. God help the Marines. I hope it gets better. We're on this trail and I, these ladies are, this is how easy it is. The Jehovah's Witnesses are on the trail, witnessing to people. And they're dressed in their dresses. They got their little setup that they put on the trail. And I was like, I think I remember them. It's been a few years, but I tend to befriend groups so I can study the mentality. This being one of them is a really great study in the occult mind and how you keep uh, members tight. And it gave me the thought, as I was looking at it, I was like, you know, I've been blacklisted in real estate. I'm wondering, I'm just wondering if it was them. Just, it just kind of dawned on me. But just, you know, more smack of the face of Pansy S. Marines. Staff Sergeant, blah, blah, blah. One, Staff Sergeant, blah, blah, blah. Two, Staff Sergeant, blah, blah. Oh, you just got promoted. Staff Sergeant, blah, blah, blah. Three. Oh, and one more comment. Bombard likes dad bobs, or whatever. Yeah, I do. Sure do. More cushion for the pushing. You people are crazy. Real people look real. I'm not looking for GQ. 